Hey guys, I had a, this is a little shopping haul and a flip through. But first I bought some mounting tape because I think by the end of the month I'm going to have another option. It's going to be a little bit different than the first one we had. Um, there will be a minimum on these, but I will do a, um, I seek out the truth and some others suggested I do a video about a week prior to the auction, um, giving you a preview of everything that's going to be up on the auction with their numbers and then that way you know what you're looking for specifically when the live auction starts but I bought that for the mounting but yesterday I seek out the truth on his Instagram was at the Dollar General and I saw that he came across this so I had to go to the Dollar General you know I did this one is uh, Fantasy Mythology uh, Advanced Coloring, and it has dragons, castles. These are single-sided, which is, is good. Pegasus. That's what my Pegasus should have looked like the other night. <laughs> On the live when I was so tired, I couldn't even function. Look at this. These are going to be fun to do. These are stairs going up, bed, little fancy windows, nice, some little soldiers, mushrooms with little gnomes, everybody knows I love the little gnomes, oh those are cute. These are cute too. Oh, she's gorgeous. She's gorgeous. Looks like she's in the water. Look at the little fishy little mermaid. Crooked castles. Oh, those are nice. Oh, look at that. What's this one called? I can't remember what these are called. It's beautiful though. Oh, look at her. Is she from the cover? Yes, look at this. I like it. Medusa. But a pretty Medusa. But he's nice. Oh, I'm going to like her for more than one. I can use that for more than one thing. Oh, taking a little nap. Oh, I like her. Nice. Look at these whales. Little fairy here. I'm liking her. Oh, that's cute. Oh, isn't she gorgeous? She's nice. And these are perforated too, which is good. Oh, look at that elephant. He's going to be fun. He's going to have a lot of bright colors in him. Okay, now, I also found in there, okay, these books here were $3 in the Dollar General. They had, and I had just been to Kmart prior. Yes, we still have a Kmart here. They had the exact same books 
for almost 10 bucks. The exact same things. And they were $3. And um, for both of these. They're both from the Fantastical Beast. Um, now, here's the only problem. The only thing that I really am not a fan of is it's double sided. Double sided. And both of them are the way. Different things in each book. So I don't, I think I could maybe use my gel pens and my, um, I know I can use my uh, color pencils, but I, I don't think I can use my markers. I'd be afraid to. I mean, the, the paper's fairly thick, but, you know, there's only a couple of these pages that I'd be okay with something bleeding through the back side. Like, see, this side, I wouldn't, it wouldn't hurt my feelings if I did markers on this, but on this side, I wouldn't want to. So that's the only thing I'm really not a big fan about with the, I see now, I really like this. And actually, I like these because you could cut these out and put them on other projects, but, but then you would be losing all of this. Oh man, so many decisions. It's gonna make my bread my bread hurt. My mind hurt. <laughs> oh, this is nice. This is cool. And these really look like the characters. They really did them justice on this. I hope you guys can see it. See? He's my favorite little creature. His little friend that travels in his pocket. Okay, so this wouldn't hurt my feelings if I did this one with some markers and it bled through on this side. However, those are cool little creatures. What's on this side? Oh, the little thief. Oh, this is a nice picture of the two of them. Oh, this one too. Oh, this is cute. He's a cutie. Can you see him? Decisions, decisions. What do y'all think? Should I just use your mark, my mark, my um, color pencils and gel on these so that I don't bleed through to the other side? Because I really like the way they have the whole. They have like a whole story on two pages you know like a double spread here I'm liking that there nothing's perforated here so I'm liking this you know the part two is coming up in the fall If you've not seen the movie, you need to. I think it's on uh, HBO. It might even be on Netflix. It's a really good show. Ooh, look at that snake. It's a triple-headed snake. Oh, wow. Hmm. I don't want to deal with a one-headed, much less a three-headed one. <laughs> okay, so that's this one, and then it had this one, 
with the same title. What is the difference between the two books? They're still double-sided. They're not perforated. Now he doesn't look as authentic as the other one did. There they are there. So we have different pictures, just two. Oh, that's a pretty good one of them. Except they kind of lost his features in this one. The other book, his features are more like him. So if you're going for the strong where they really looks like them, this this book is better at that than this one. And I really wish they were single backed on these things. Ooh, I like the wand. We've got all kinds of color book pages coming up. I already have them, I think, scheduled all the way through this month, or they're already done and in, in the schedule rotation. Sorry I didn't have a video on Saturday. I am just really exhausted. I had to rearrange a bunch of stuff in my apartment, and I've been making sure I've had videos every single day. I think I had like 50 consecutive days where I had videos, and when you art it, and then you edit it, and then you schedule it, it's it's a long time. Because I'm taking like a two, two and a half to three hour session and getting it down to like 10 minutes, 13 minutes or less for y'all to see. It's time consuming. I enjoy it. I'm not complaining, but just trying to give you a, I had to just kind of take some downtime Saturday and I already had a video for Sunday. I didn't have one for today. So now see this looks like him. The guy that played him. Um, I can't think of his dad's name now. This is cool. So we're having a little flip through here. Any suggestions on which book I should do or what page I should do in an upcoming video? Now mind you, I've got several before this to do, but if you put in the comments below what one you think I ought to do or what one you would like to see me do first out of the books, let me know. I will definitely take that, the one that's uh, mentioned the most in the comments, I'll do that one first. So if you guys have any ones that you'd like to see me do first, let me know. These are awesome. Muggle worthy. <laughs> I like that. Oh, now this is pretty. This would be a lot, a lot, a lot of work. But it is pretty. Well, this is a good picture of him. I really, I like this real well, and I think it's because it makes me feel um, the steampunk thing. But you know, I love my steampunk. Okay, this is by Harper Design. I wonder what this is. This by the same company or no? Same company, Harper Design. I wonder what the difference is that one of them looks more realistic than the other because they are published at the same time in the same year. I don't know. Anyway, so these are my three little finds. Thank you, Bat. I will link um, 
I seek out the truth. He does a lot of hiking videos in Arizona and he goes to like, um, the local parks and the, um, Oh, the things where the game wardens and all them people go to. He, he, if you ever go towards the Tucson area and you're wanting things to do outdoorsy, you really need to watch I Seek Out the Truth. And the, he goes to those that have bike paths, no bike paths, animals welcome, no animals welcome. Um, hiking, everything from low impact hiking to extreme hiking paths. He's got the whole genre covered. So no matter where you are in your field of it, he can tell, if you watch his videos, you will know exactly what parks and stuff you want to go, which cuts out a lot. It helps you plan your trips better, and you'll know exactly what you want to do when you get there. I'm going to put the link to actually got the Truth's channel in my description, and we affectionately call him the Bat. So the Bat, thank you for... Um, pointing these out in your Instagram post yesterday and um, cuz I it made me go and look for it and we actually had it I was really worried cuz mine never seems to be stocked and it's well kept as as uh, yours is with that being said everybody I have got some videos to make and create for you so I need to get off of here so leave me a like comment on if you saw something in one of these books you'd like to see me do first and if you haven't subscribed what are you waiting on it's free that's bat's favorite saying and uh, don't forget to hit the bell it lets you know uh, anytime I upload and new contents coming out I do everything from um, adult color books to mini canvases to big canvases to paper art to just a little bit of everything so I have something for everybody out there and I have almost 450 videos to pick from I go to my playlist pick them out there you go I even have live events so enjoy and I will see you in the very next video and everybody have a fantastic day